Support for West Virginia at 150 is provided by the West Virginia Division of Tourism. More information at wvtourism.com slash statehood or 1-800-225-5982 and by the West Virginia and Regional History Center at the WVU Library. Online at libraries.wvu.edu. West Virginia at 150. 1952, Johnny Johnson hires Chuck Berry. He was born and raised in Fairmont. In his late 20s, Johnny Johnson's trio was the hottest band in the hottest nightclub in East St. Louis. On New Year's Eve, Johnny hired an inexperienced but talented Chuck Berry to fill in for one night. Two years later, they recorded Maybelline, and it became their first top 10 song. Their collaboration went on for 20 years. Chuck Berry's song, Johnny Be Good, was really about Johnny Johnson. His nomination petition for the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame shows how respected he was among the greats of rock and roll. West Virginia's Johnny Johnson, a founding father of rock and roll. West Virginia at 150, a daily celebration of West Virginia's 150 years. Support for West Virginia at 150 is provided by WVU Online at West Virginia University on the web at online.wvu.edu.